We continue to follow more breaking news, this time out of Southwest Miami-Dade. A fire breaking out at a restaurant overnight. We have Local 10's Trent Kelly. He spoke to the owners and he's live from the scene of where those flames broke out. Trent. Well, JC, Nikki, I actually just got an update from first responders. They now tell me one firefighter was injured during all of this. But if you take a look behind me, you can see the business at the center of this fire investigation. This is the Delicias de España restaurant on Southwest 40th Street and 57th Avenue. Miami-Dade Fire Rescue still here at the scene going in and out of that business as they try to figure out what sparked this fire overnight. We know firefighters first got the call around 1220 this morning. After arriving, they found heavy smoke and flames inside the restaurant's kitchen area. Now, it took crews roughly about an hour to put it all out, but by that point, the damage had already been done. This is a family-owned business, which was started about 20 years ago. The owners literally building this place from the ground up. Their flagship location, one of three across the county, now left severely damaged. In fact, I spoke to the owner's grandson a bit earlier this morning about what this loss means for his family. It's hard. It's hard, and especially when you when you walk inside and you see the the inside how it is. Because from the outside, it doesn't look too bad, but when you go inside, it it, it is bad. Now, take a look at your screen here. This is a photo showing some of the thick. Uh, smoke that came billowing out of the building overnight. That's what it looked like when firefighters first arrived. As for the damage to the inside of the business, well, you can tell by these photos, it is pretty extensive. Pretty much everything in that dining room area now charred and covered in soot. As for the cause of this fire, I'm told that is still under investigation right now. One reason firefighters are still out here at the scene. They estimate this business to be a total loss, but the owners, though, tell me once the scene is cleared, they're hoping to go inside and be able to salvage enough so that they can rebuild and hopefully stay open at this well-known location. That's the latest here in Southwest Miami-Dade. Trent Kelly, Local 10 News.